I'm gonna be playing the Firebrand on Escalation 2. Was supposed to do that yesterday, but didn't actually select the option. Whoops. Select ship the Firebrand with its iconic flat cannon that uses heat and generates heat. Everything else is whatever. This is the maximum, right? Yeah, that's the maximum. I think I unlocked plus one subsystems on sale in shops. I want to grab that. Plus one reactor power, plus one capacity, plus one subsystems on sale. All right, we got that extra power. Got to assign it. Got to remember to do that. Kind of wish the game would remind you to do that. All right. Elite enemies start combat with a modifier, minus one fuel on start, and one less fuel on entering a sector, and enemy, regular enemies have more hit points. This is a regular enemy. Busy with trying to prevent civilians from fleeing the system. Only a security drone has noticed our approach. It's heading our way on an intercept course. Plus three hit points. I don't really care about that, but that is a bigger weapon. That is a bigger weapon. Usually it's a pulse laser. Now it's a beam sweep. We can't block that with a shield pulse. We need to find a bigger shield. We have a barrier in deck, so we just need to find it. In the meantime, play this for power. Fire. Fire. Throw that away. There's our barrier. Can fire another one of these. Play this first. Four to seven damage. Cool, we can just break it. That works. Don't even need this. Throw that away. Throw that away. Oh, there's no need to, because our draw pile is empty. Whoops. Um, all right, we're going to get a barrier next turn, so we don't need this. Throw that out. We should just break them next turn with this. I'm sorry, what? I didn't break them? Oh, the max damage is increased by heat, not the minimum damage. Okay. So we're just unlucky. It's okay, we got the barrier. Play that out. There we go. Very first fight. Fought it through with it without taking any damage, thus proving that we're not terrible at this game. Heat shift, I don't like it. Uh, auto shield, eh. Energy surge, eh. Force draw. Because drawing is power. After we've breached the blockade, multiple ships try to make a run and exit the system. As we mix in with the group of civilian vessels, the Starkin gunships break off pursuit and focus on keeping the fleeing ships in. Incoming message, request captain. It's impossible to isolate the source with so many ships grouped together. Greetings, captain. Impressive skills you've shown there. I could use the services of a bold freelancer such as yourself. I'm a data broker by trade, willing to offer a generous reward in exchange for some valuable intel. I need to gather data about what's going on in the system. All you need to do is visit four waypoint nodes. I will transfer 150 credits upon completion. By the way, pick a weapon for my reserves while you're at it. You'll need all the firepower you can get. Some missing punctuation there. Consider an investment in your future. So we can take pulse laser, mass driver, 
Missile rack. Well, if I want to win, I'm going to pick the mass driver. That worked last time. <laughs> it was insane last time. Uh, okay, I just need to hit four waypoints. There's a waypoint, there's a waypoint, there's a waypoint. Do I want to do something like this? I want to go down here. I don't want to hit any of these stations and I don't care about this. I mean, it, it'd be... Hmm. Going through here wouldn't be terrible because there's a neutral station over here. This, this kind of doesn't matter. I could just go here, here, here. Bounce back here. Just coast. If there's anything I like, I'll stop by. Not far from your current position, a Starkin merchant ship slows down in order to inspect the likeness of you being a potential client. Seem reluctant to reach out to us. Would you like to contact them in order to browse their equipment catalog, Captain? I don't have enough money. Nah, I might as well incur it. There's no reason not to. Yeah, okay, I don't have enough money. <laughs> Move on. The ship's database shows that there's an abandoned refueling platform in this quadrant. All right, we'll go there. We'll go there, we'll go from here. No, we'll go from... Hmm. It'd almost be better if we went like this way. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah. Infrared sensors. Infrared sensors detect a large heat spike not too far from our current position. Possibly from a recent battle or a reactor malfunction. Coordinates have been added to the map. I don't know how we get there. I don't think we can. What's our escape pod here? Oh. Okay, 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 okay. So what if we go here, 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 coast, here, 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 coast? Could that work? Maybe. Maybe. It's hard to pass up on an escape pod. We're registering a short range emergency signal from an escape pod up ahead. I don't know why you wouldn't pick it up. Greetings, Captain. Looks like I owe you my life. The recycler system in that pod was almost out of power. Name's Wolf. Used to be a captain myself until recently. There was a mutiny on my ship. Pirates can get real antsy when times are lean. My second in command took advantage of that to turn the crew against me. This doesn't look like the inside of a Solari patrol ship, so let me join your crew and make myself useful. Identified our guest, he's a notorious pirate with a bounty on his head. I suggest we hold him in the brig until the first station, collect an easy 150 without getting in trouble for harboring a known criminal. Yeah. I actually need the achievement to turn this guy into a Starkin uh, station, and I don't see one on the map. It's right there, actually. You throw him in the brig. I need to get here. And I can do that if I go, like... Original path. Bump. Bump. One, two, three. Or five. And then we just we just coast. It's kinda inefficient, but I want that achievement, so I'm doing it. Go to this last waypoint node. We get paid. 
technical officer prepares to transfer the last data packet from your flight computer and sensors. A few minutes later, you get a message transmission. Thank you for your services. As per our agreement, the funds have been transferred. Until we meet again, Captain, which is never. We will never meet again. Judging by the time between the data transfer and the message, the data broker ship should be here, but our sensors aren't picking anything up. Oh, th that's right, there's the actual node we have to do. Traversing hostile space, you come across a dense asteroid field coated with a stealth composite. Someone must have left this as a trap. Couldn't dodge it in time, so you take four damage. Uh, incoming transmission from a Solari patrol ship up ahead. Oh, hail Captain. Contracting unverified gunships is not standard protocol, but I'm hoping you'll be of service. Pirate vessel has been pillaging shipping lanes in the vicinity, and due to current events in this system, our resources are stretched thin. We would like you to contact contract you in securing shipping routes. If you fulfill the contract, I'll make sure to notify command commander of your assistance in addition to the payment. You can always use the service of trustworthy freelancers. I don't think there's any reason to say no. So we get coordinates to a pre-established rendezvous point on your map. Oh. Um. I'm not sure if we can make that work. I don't know if we have enough fuel. We'll see. After this fight. Just kidding. We're just... I don't want to fight. You are in free roamer controlled space, so please provide your whole identification number as the... Well, as the identity of everyone on board. Cool. We're cool. Everything's cool. The wreckage in front of us seems to be the source of a signal our sensors detected. The ship's reactor is close to a critical state. It could explode at any time. No survivors detected on board. Let's move in. Let's get some stuff. Try to maneuver the salvage drone to get a good angle, but the gripper mechanisms break off from the tension as it tries to dislodge the equipment from its hard point. The reactor's coolant started leaking from the wreckage. What do you want to do? Keep going. The gripper snaps off again. The reactor is borderline critical and tensions run high. You really should consider putting the safety of your crew first and leave. I've got one more shot at this, but you risk hurting crew morale as well as your ship's hull. You know what? I don't want to hurt morale. Let's let that go. We depart at full burn. The reactor goes critical shortly after, but you take no damage. Incoming message from a deadweight captain. Coming from a nearby ship marked as a civilian. Let's hear him. Hail friend. Seem to be a well-armed gunship. Might you be looking to make a nice lump sum of credits and reap some spoils? It's lots of chaos and being on our good side will see you become a rich person in no time. Got a special transponder here, and all you need to do is equip it on your ship and attack that solitary Starkin patrol vessel further up ahead. With no further repercussions, I might add, because they won't be able to trace it to you. Uh... Sir, the transponder belongs to a Solari vessel. Attacking one of ours with it will spark a local conflict. But I hate both of them, so that's good. <laughs> Let's do it. Do this right and we'll all go rich plundering those who would oppress us. This is insanity. Oh. This is insanity. No reward can be worth the chaos and loss of life this will bring. Well. Should have seen that coming. Got an incoming laser pulse. So we'll just put up a shield pulse, I think. 
There's no reason not to use the barrier. You are now shielded. Throw that away. And then we can fire this and fire this. The combo. No shred. Do I hold on to this? I think I do, because I do not have that many cards in my in my pile yet. Alright, and now we're gonna get hit with a whole bunch of stuff. Um I think we do do this. And then Nope, I did that out of order. I should have radiated first. I still want to shoot this and get lucky. I think we're just going to take a little bit of damage because I misplayed that. Whoops. Alright, this we absolutely want to block, so... Play this cool. Or we can just blow it up. And blow that up too. No shields. You can go out too. Okay. I think four straw is dead. Uh, we don't need shields. I would like to play this just to get heat up. Heat thing's overloaded. Fire that. There we go. Awesome. Calculate overheat. Ugh. Pyroelectric round. That's cool. This looks cool. No pun intended. I don't know if I want increased conduction. Maybe I do. That's good too, but then I I would rather have another force draw, because force draw is so good. I mean this seems good. This seems good. And it's it's a uh, It's a way to generate heat, and then maybe you'll generate some damage too. Hey, plus one the pirate relations. I knew you'd have it in you. Here's your payoff for a job well done. This should keep those dogs busy for a good while. So now we get to capitalize on our hard work. I was hoping to get some fuel, but... Trade security. I think I need to dock here, buy two fuel. Then I can go here. Yeah. Dock with the station, pay 40 credits to dock anyway. I don't want to collect the bounty yet. I do want to buy two fuel. And then crew activity. Let's go in the hangar. We got that perk that gives us better shops. I want to, I want to actually make use of it. Useless. Add one card slot at the start of combat. That's pretty good. Gain three shields if you end your turn within a DN. I f I find a lot of value with this one. Okay, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. This is pretty good. I want to buy all of them. I can't afford all of them. Hmm. What do I want the most? This one is really good, and this one is really good. Does it go anywhere? Wait a minute, this can only go in my engineering bay. 
or resource bay. So I can't I can't get both of these. And if I had to choose this one or this one, I'd rather have this one. Yep. Yep. And we got 30 credits left. Alright, now we need to find enough credits that we can afford enough fuel to go from here to here and pick up this fuel station on the way. No biggie. Go to this conflict zone. Traversing Solari conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship moves in to intercept. Incoming flak. Well, we have a shield pulse. We also have a force draw. So I'm feeling if we shoot this first. Uh, we could fire this now. We don't have to. We could. Play this. The resources. So if we need to, we can fire the kinetic catapult. Let's discard that. There, okay. Blazing Barrage. 3 to 15 damage. Was that the plan? No. That's a stupid plan, isn't it? What am I doing? What am I doing? I'm so confused. Uh, I can do this to play the barrier. And then we'll take five overheat. Not sure why I did that. I should have just played the kinetic catapult. I still can, or I could play the tungsten round. I just play that, radiate, get our heat down, save this. Incoming missile. Uh, can we get a kill here? I don't think so. We can definitely play this. This is safe. Do I play this as well? Four to nine, four to eleven, four to thirteen. That's not enough. Let's bust this. All right, and this is definitely a kill. So much unnecessary damage. Okay, kinetic catapult is unnecessary. Charge barrier is not bad. Accelerant, don't like it. Charge barrier? Take on the elite. Oh, or maybe not. When you match the rendezvous point, you find a civilian cargo ship already waiting. You match speed and flight pass and then proceed to run silent along the massive freighter. Before long, you pick up the signal of the pirate ship, headed straight for the freighter. Its civilian grade sensors have not picked up the enemy ship yet. What do you want to do? Let's, uh, let's be friends. Let's warn them away. The Solari have it out for us, I. Best we move on, then, and keep them guessing. We left a little something behind to thank you, friend. It's an autocannon. I think it's an autocannon every time. 
not complaining. All right. As you transit through a civilian region of Solari space, you get an encoded type beam message. The set of coordinates to the local deadweight base of activities. It appears to be a logistics hub. Oh, this is the, the this is the great. This is the uh, pirate base. As soon as you approach the docking bay, the station's asteroid point defense cannons lock on your ship. Oh, right. I have <laughs> I have the dude. Friends don't let friends rot in jail. Hand over Wolf upon docking. We can put this little misunderstanding behind us. Didn't he? Didn't he get mutinied? I'll take the non-lethal damage. What is that? Or non-lethal damage. Okay, what? Your ship quickly turns around and flies away from the facility. High G burn takes its toll on the crew, but everyone is alive. After you're at arm's way, you run across a damage diagnosis. Zero whole damage taken. Cool. The ship's comms pick up a nearby distress call. Shortly after moving in to investigate. The infrared sensors flare up from an explosion. Oh, the wreckage in front of us seems to be the source. The ship's reactor is close to a critical... Okay, it's a wreckage. Let's move in. Upon closer inspection, you see a piece of equipment that's still in working condition. Let's get it. You discover that you weren't the only one stupid enough to attempt this salvage. The other ship panics and prepares to engage. Oh, you got two lasers? That's cute. I ain't got one laser. Uh, yeah. And then I'm probably gonna need to balance production to get more mass. Probably. Just get the shield up. It's fine. We'll have to deal with Rampart. But. Whatever. This is a really expensive four ordnance to do two damage. I don't want that. And I, I do need to produce mass. Uh, uh, do I... Do I pyroelectric round? I think I think it's actually worth it to do that. Cool. For some reason, I thought this needed mass and not energy. Whoops. But you know what? It's fine. Infrared pulse. Uh Oh, if I'm overheated it doubles double damage. Okay, that's fine. Well, I would like to gain two energy so I can raise the shield. We'll just raise that shield up. Why is it not going? Come on. And I do need to start shooting, so I will. Cool. That was fun. I need more mass. Six four is ten, but that's twelve coming in. Uh can we break it? Oh yeah, we can break it. We break that. And we do this. And then we barrier. And we're fine. We even shoot this. There it is. 
Now we have mass. Deal four damage plus one damage for each enemy heat over the threshold. Okay. How about no? Uh, what if I do this? And then I do this? Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, so close. Can we force draw a solution? No reason not to play that. Oh, come on. Come on. That's seven. Oh, wait, hold on. I can fix this. Cool, and then we just... Oh, I don't need to do that. But it spent the thing anyway, great. Great. PDC repeater? Mm -hmm. Force draw. I like overheating. Precious time was lost in combat, but the wreckage is still there. The reactor is slowly inching towards a critical state, but there's still left some time for salvaging any useful equipment. Let's do it. 30% chance to succeed, 25% chance to explode. We don't get text. Gripper tool has a firm hold on the last attachment point. You pull it to one side and it clicks open. And now we have the suppressor mark one. We're gonna sell this. Uh. Okay, yeah, we're gonna sell that. I would rather have a shield. Anyway. To the conflict zone. An unregistered ship present in contested Stark in space is approaching on attack vector. Well, what do we do to that? So I have a question. If I fire the blazing barrage and I get two heat, and then I play radiate, do I get two energy from that? Let's find out. I do not. Good to know. Good to know. Uh, and then, do I have, I have, ju I just fired this. So, playing this will return one thing into my deck. Totally fine with that. Totally fine with that. Good. Bad. Okay, I don't have the power. I, I need more power. Okay, firing a melting clip would be pointless. Can balance production. So you'd fire this and then kinetic catapult to take out the flak barrage. Uh, I could have played this. I guess there's nothing I can do about that. Okay, lay that out. We've got it'd be really nice to take this out so I stop taking damage from it. Yeah, exactly, exactly. 
Put that down. Oh, I just, that's a kill. Okay. Expulsion. What does Heated Chill actually do? Okay. This might be good. I think I'd rather have a PDC burst, but this might be good. Because it does lower your heat. The heated shell does lower your heat. If it if it shreds, which is, you know, kind of the goal. Maybe maybe I will go with this. Maybe we'll go with this. Turns heat into damage. We do need power to make it work. Alright. Traversing Solari conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship moves in to intercept. got no missiles. We can throw this away. We've got incoming covering fire. We can block that with a barrier. Uh, I'm not playing this, so throw that away. I think it's safe to fire both of these. Play this as well to get a little extra heat. Oh, perfect. And we still get a shield. And now we got this nonsense to worry about. So there's two things we could do. We can go all in on heat. We can fire this and hope that we are very lucky. I, mean, I kind of want to do that. I don't. I don't really. Heat sinks overloaded. Uh. Okay. Pyroelectric round is useless, but we should hold on to it. We can play the shield pulse. No, we should throw this away. We should throw this away. Fire this. Didn't do it. Gonna be taking a lot of damage in just a moment. Uh, we will boost this up to nine because we have the contingency module. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Shields are still up. Very lucky. <laughs> we gotta empty our hand. Gotta empty it. I need the shield. Okay. Uh, let us over... Okay, do we overheat or do we raise shields? This is about to break, so I think we, I think we go for it. Yeah. Okay, does this does this fire first? This one. Does this fire first or does does our heat go down first? Oh, it fires first. Nice. Heavy barrage. Uh well, shoot. That's not good. That's not good. That's a lot of damage. What do I have? Oh, all our blazing... Nope, just kidding. Sorted by cooldown. We have... 
Nothing worth drawing for. It would be nice to get two more heat. Uh, it would be nice to break that. <laughs> One health. Okay, our deck has the kill. Heat sinks overloaded. Play that. Draw the kill. Good stuff. Melting clip, not bad. Barricade? Gain plus two shield, plus plus two for every production engineering. Disable, or for every energy produced. Disable one energy production for one turn. What kind of ship do you think I'm running? I really don't want this. I'd rather have money. This is fine too, actually. Fly over here to this conflict zone where we fight a patrol ship because traveling in Solari conflict zones is strictly prohibited. like to fire this immediately. Get some more of this and then fire this. Good stuff. And then we lower heat. Optimal temperatures reached. Enemy missile is down. Okay. I don't want to get improvised flacked, so I will just chill. Or will I? Because I have this. If I can break this A+, plus, can this break that? Uh, it'll do three to seven damage. Am I lucky? If I draw, what do I draw into? I could draw a Blazing Barrage. A Blazing Barrage is going to do it. Oh, but I don't have the I don't have the the ordinance to do that. So I just need to be lucky. Uh, playing this for two heat, so that this is guaranteed to shred, which I did need to do. Yeah, we fire this. Okay, there it is. Pop that. Uh, don't want to play that. Or that. Yeah. I would like to draw my other PDC right now, please. Oh. I don't have another PDC. Okay. Well, I would like to uh, cry. Do I have a shield of any kind? No, I don't. I don't even have weapons of any kind. All right, let's play this. Uh... Go for it. No world where we play that. We don't have enough energy. Optimal temperatures reached. Oof. Or 
We're about to get volleyed. And that's bad. For obvious reasons. What is my what is the card in my deck? Oh, that's good. I need that. Uh I would like it. That just got me a bunch of resources. Okay, okay, this is great. This is great. Um, let's go for it. Fire that. Fire this. This is a kill. That's a kill. Blazing Barrage. Perfect. Energy Surge might be good too. Cool. Hey, we also got a little hole patched up from the salvage. Alright. Next conflict zone. Traversing the Stark in conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship is moving to investigate. Intercept. Cool, we got a laser pulse that's gonna fire now, and another one's gonna fire next turn. We've got the cards to block it. I don't think we can break the lasers this turn. Nope, it's okay though. We'll play the charge barrier. And we'll just chill. Oh wow, okay. That's 10, 10 laser damage coming in. We've only got not 10 shield until now. Okay. So now we can just play it chill. I don't want to fire this because I don't have the heat, but I don't want to draw. Maybe I do want to draw. I think that was the right call. We'll just fire this for the shred. Uh, and this. Put those back in the... in the deck. So now we've got... our Radiant Core set up. Um, I want to generate a lot of heat. We drew our PDC burst at the perfect time, too. Enemy missile is down. And we have no incoming damage, so I don't need this. Well, I didn't need any of that, but that's okay. I don't need to overheat yet. I'm not... I'm not really feeling the urgency. So what if I just chill? Okay, perfect. Enemy down. Should I have played this? Yes. bunch of cards that need energy and no energy. I'm about to take six damage. It doesn't matter. I can't shoot this missile down, so no amount of shields I put up are going to matter. This can't kill. But it does help. Uh, you are now shielded. 
Yep, yep. 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 Alright, got a lot of money. Seabeck shot. I have to take it. I have to. Alright, one more conflict zone. I... I can't read it. <laughs> I've read it too many times. Alright, you got a big laser coming. 10 damage. Painful. Uh... I don't really see a way to... Protect us from that laser. That's gonna kill us too. I need to shoot it down with this. So what I need to do is I need to okay, two energy, weapon coolant. Um, fire this to get my heat up to four. That won't do it. This isn't going to work. It might work. It might work. Just believe. Just believe. Okay, now this is 12 damage and that has 12 health. So if we do this... Oh. Well, we can't do that. So rip this run. Ah. Yeah. Didn't believe. More things to sell, more reactor power, and more capacity. Probably would have found a lot more success if I had ever upgraded my reactor that game. Instead of buying uh, components which were admittedly pretty good. They were good components. Not good enough. Alright. New run. New run. Busy with trying to prevent civilians from fleeing the system. Only a security drone has noticed our approach. It's heading this way on an intercept course. Bum, bum, bum. Put that out. Fire the black cannon. And then this is going to shred. Damn it. Optimal temperatures reached. Uh, yeah, there's no downside to firing this. But if I play the weapon coolant first, it'll do more damage because I'm lucky. Great work. Oh shoot, I forgot to put my reactor power. Doesn't matter. A charged barrier. Melting clip is good. It's a good one. It's a good one. Please remember to add energy to your reactor. And then let's go to the Sector Gateway. After we breach the blockade, multiple ships try to make a run and exit the system. As we mix in with the group of civilian vessels, the Starkin gunships break off pursuit and focus on keeping the fleeing ships in. Incoming message request, Captain. It's impossible to isolate the source with so many ships grouped together. Greetings, Captain. Impressive skills you've shown there. I could use the services of a bold freelancer such as yourself. I'm a data broker by trade, willing to offer a generous reward in exchange for some valuable intel. I need to gather data on the most powerful gunships in this sector. All you need to do is send your combat logs on the specified coordinates after fighting two elite ships, and I will transfer 150 credits on delivery. Oh, and by the way, pick a weapon from my reserves while you're at it. 
You need all the firepower you can get. Consider it an investment in your future. Well, I do like the mass driver. I do like it. Light flak is good too. Pulse laser. This is not the ship for that. Let's go with the mass driver. Uh, and there's an elite comet that I don't want to fight. And there's an elite comet that I do want to fight. So we want to go in this direction. So I'm thinking standard, go this way, jump over here, go that way. And we'll hit the neutral space station, which is always in the same place, I guess. I don't know. Traversing Solari conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship moves in to intercept. Incoming spread shot. Heat sinks overloaded. Go ahead and let that fire. And then we finish them once and for all. Yay. And then play that, because why not? So that we can play this. Okay, can we break this? We can. Get you out of there, get you out of there. Uh, let's keep the rest, because I my deck is empty, so it doesn't matter. Fire and forget. Reinforced Accelerant. This turn, add plus one railgun damage for every support card played. No. You know what? I will take the energy surge. I will take it. Because I feel like our energy production is so bad on this ship that we can get value out of that energy surge. Here we're going to this waypoint where we will find a free roamer merchant ship which slows down in order to inspect the likeness of you being a potential client. Let's ask them about their equipment. Damn it. I'm too poor. All right. A rogue ship in violation of free roamer space has suddenly come out of hiding and is preparing to attack us. Bold move. Let's see if it pays off. I don't want to see this in my opening hand, but I guess it doesn't matter because there's nothing, there's no threat to us at this time. Play that. Hmm. There's a good odds that this is going to shred. Nope. All right, I would like to break this, but I have no way to do that. So in the absence of that, what is this gonna do? Minus one enemy shield duration, or half their shield instead. That's bad. Kinda need my shield. What we can do, pull this out. Barely scratched. Now we don't need shield. And then I guess we just blow them out of the sky. Yeah.
Laser Pulse coming online now. I mean, ma match it with the Shield Pulse. Failure. Alright. Maybe we can make an auto shield work. Force draw, what am I doing? I see force draw, I pick it every time. I like how force draw looks like it's a balance card. Like for the average deck. Cause it draws you a lot of cards, but it gives you a lot of heat. And then you put it on the ship that's like heat is a good thing. Clever. A Stark and unnamed ship is being attacked by a deadweight gunship. The civilian ship's hull integrity is critical. Stay out of this, Captain. We have a score to settle with that Stark and ship. Do I do this? If we are to intervene in time, our only option is to fire on the attacking ship and draw its attention. Firing our weapons without initiating combat protocols first will leave our ship at a disadvantage in the upcoming fight. Uh, I mean, I like. I don't, I don't care about dead weight relations, and I do not care about Starkin relations, but I like fighting. I like fighting. Oh, they're gonna fire a missile at us immediately. We can't block that with shields because they'll get knocked out by the ion. Oh no, they won't because that's a missile. Just kidding. Get that shield up. Should have played that in the opposite order. Whoops. We'll sit on this. Firing another missile, this time with an ion missile. Great. All right. Uh, we have four cards in our deck. One of them is a shield pulse, which is not what we need. So I don't need to play this. I don't really need to play this. Let's fire this. Uh, I shouldn't have done that. Cause that, that was just extra heat for no reason. Which is a good thing on this ship. Optimal temperatures reached. Yep. We've gotten malware. There go our there goes our cards. It's okay. We're just gonna do this. clip. I'd rather have a charge barrier. Pyroelectric ground sounds good too. Honestly, that's this sounds pretty good. I'll take that. Cuz remember, heat is good. Ooh, we got some damage patched up. Nice job. Let's go to this waypoint. You fly through a civilian agro-industrial production cluster. There does not seem to be anything ordinary about it. Out of the ordinary about it. Let's fight some deadweights. Deadweight conflict zones are impossible to police with the limited resources of the local factions. Deadweight ship has locked onto our drive signature and is approaching from starboard.
So we drew the energy surge, but we didn't draw any shields. I need to put more shields in my deck, because I don't know what I expect. Uh, is there any way to make this? There's not. There's no way to make this destroy the flak barrage. So if I play this for heat, that'll reduce the shred requirement to five. If I play, okay, so if I play this, heat requirement to four, and then I play this, heat requirement to eight. This is guaranteed to shred. Fire that. Doesn't matter. Flacus. Great. Now they've got a lot of weapons firing at us. What are we going to do about that? We can fire this and then this. That might work, actually. Well, it almost worked. Almost. Uh, if I produce mass, nope. Wait a minute. If I draw nothing, I have no weapons that doesn't work. We're going to get flacked again. Damn it, there's the asteroid, whatever. Die. Cascade shot? Deal six damage on equipment destroy, return this card to your draw pile. That's really good, uh, a really good cost for that damage. That's an incredible sh cost. Yeah. All right. The console flashes red all of a sudden, signaling that our sensors have been overloaded. We will have to rely on our short range scanners until we manage to restore them. So we have disadvantage for the next two nodes. Lucky us, let's fight an elite now. We're smart. Come across an advanced combat vessel. Its mission is to enforce Solari law on your ass. Well, this is not great to fire in the opening for Salvo. Or is it? I don't, I don't even, like, yeah, just play that. Get that out of my hand. Retribution? Ugh. Garbage. Okay. So one thing we can do is we can play the Energy Surge and the Force Draw and throw this away, unfortunately. To generate a bunch of heat. I guess it's a barrier, which is good. Uh, do we fire this? Yeah. Suboptimal hit. Can generate more mass. Do I want to generate more mass? I don't think I do. I mean, I do, I do, I do, I do want to generate more mass. Play that for top shields, because we're not breaking this. Alright, and then... This can't hurt us. Minimum damage anyway. <laughs>
Great. Well, that's fine. Uh, bust that down. Oh, and that's it. That's all we get to do. Can I get a melting clip? No, I can't. I'm not cool enough. Can I get more ordnance? I can, though. If we bust this, there's a chance that we'll take four less damage. Whoop. I will take that. Ooh, missile lock. Plus one missile damage, add a firefly to your drop pile for every 12 hull damage dealt by missiles in a single turn. Okay, Firestorm. What are, the heck are Pyroclast attacks? 50% max flak damage while overheated. And then you will instantly overheat. That's not true. Coolant loss doesn't mean you overheat. Operations cool off. Reduce your heat by your threshold amount. I mean, that cools you off. This feels like it could, this feels like it could work. I should, I should really get, get more shields, but this, th this feels like it could really work. So I'm gonna go for it. You know what? Greater mass. Into a conflict zone. Traversing Starkin conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship moves in to intercept. Startled, the crew rush to their stations. Fortunately, I'm not being attacked this turn, so that's fine. We'll just fire this off. And then do this in the wrong order to accomplish nothing. Okay, I can raise shields pretty good. Shielding enhanced. Uh, listen here. Blazing Barrage. You can replay that. Good shot. Good shot. Good shot. That just saved us two damage. Okay. fire both of these to do 14 damage which is not enough to break this but now it is Enemy shields down. okay 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 I see a combo But I didn't draw any flex, so it's not really a combo. This doesn't really work, but I'm gonna do it anyway. This should have increased my max damage, right? By 50%. Why is that not reflected? 
That was minimum damage. Give me that again. Do that again. I thought this card worked. I'm sorry. Auto shield. Alright, there's an elite combat right there. Kind of need... We need it. So let's do it. An advanced combat vessel is what you come across. Its mission is to enforce Solari law and secure control of the region. The ship identifies you as being in violation of Solari controlled space as engaging its combat protocols. Bring it on. Oops, all energy. Just kidding. There's one thing here. Uh, I can play the Radiate in the right order this time. Throw shields up to 10, which should block this damage. We can do that. We'll sit on that. There's a chance that this matters. There's a chance. Dang it. I didn't want to see that. Okay. What I'm gonna do. Play this. And play this. Lose all my coolant. And then we're going to enjoy crazy amounts of damage. Four to ten? Come on. Come on. This doesn't work. That is not 50% max flax damage. Flak damage. Well, we did break this, so. And then we gotta do this to cool off, and we can't. So we're just gonna take a lot of heat damage. Great. At least I broke their weapons. Okay. I'll do eight damage. I don't care. I just want to cool off. Like, I guess I guess I can fire this. I would like to stop taking heat damage. Shields up, Captain. Okay. Fire this for a good price. There we go. Do I melting clip? Get that out of here. Reactor's overheating. Yeah, it is. Gain credits. Gain an accumulator. Never doing that. I would like another auto shield. That sounds fun. I'm not convinced this works. I wonder if I should take that on my deck. We broke our second elite, so we get paid. By the time your crew has finished gathering any useful salvage from the enemy wreckage, combat log data transfer is complete. Thank you for your services. As per our agreement, the funds have been transferred. Until we meet again, Captain. They should be in the sector, but you can't detect them because... You don't know.
All right, main course, resume course. Free roamer ship is drifting with its thrusters off. All systems seem to be operational from the engines. They contact you. Greetings, Captain. We were en route to sell some scrap, but our engines broke down before we could cash in, leaving us stranded here with no credits to call on a maintenance ship. We may not be on the best terms, but surely you agree that stranded is a horrible way to go? Please help us out. Sure. We've been drifting for a couple days now, and we're fearing pirates might find our ship first. We don't have much to give, but please take this support subsystem. Upon his return, you notice that your engineer comes out of the shuttle holding a support system. He shrugs as he puts it down, leaving you to make the next move. I will take that, thank you. I will never take that. This is nice if I had a launcher. Great. An unregistered ship present in contested Solari space is approaching on an attack vector. Enemy has fire support from other ships in the area. I hate it. I'm regretting this card more and more. Ah, uh, they're firing covering fire? Alright, 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 alright. We've got force draw. We've got this. Throw that away. Do we fire this now? No. Hold on to it. Need the heat. There's auto shield. Good stuff. Uh, and then we auto shield. Burn this. Minimize the amount of heat damage we're about to take. good. It's just getting hit with cluttering fire as long as we have a shield. Uh, we're about to not have a shield. That's just, I'm just kidding. We still have shield. Uh, we, we can just break that. Let's just break it. Let's do this. You don't have a ship anymore. Melting clip is good. Coolant flow is eh, equivalence. We don't spend that much energy. I don't think I want a third melting clip. I'll skip. Woohoo! Four hole points. Incoming transmission from a Solari patrol ship up ahead. Hail Captain. Contacting unverified gunships is not standard protocol, but I'm hoping you may be of service. A pirate vessel has been pillaging shipping lanes in the vicinity, and due to recent events in the system, our resources are stretched thin. We would like to contact you in securing our shipping routes. If you fulfill the contract, I will make sure to notify my commander of your assistance. In addition to the payment, we can always use the service of trustworthy freelancers. Yeah. The young Solari captain transmits the coordinates to a pre-established rendezvous point on your map, where you're to meet up with one of the freighters. Over there, mm, one, two, three, four. We need four fuel, so we gotta buy three fuel. Get drunk, head to the hangar. Not selling any missiles, so we can sell this. 
Never, never installing that. A radiator can only have one. PDC might be nice. A maintenance bay. I haven't played with this, but I'm not impressed by what it does. Eh. Cycle feeder. No. Magnetic saturation. That doesn't I don't I don't spam the railgun. Contingency module. I do like that. Static charge. We don't have We don't have a ion cannon. Repair kit. Repair three hole at the start of every battle. That sounds good, actually. Can buy. This needs to go on an engineering bay. None of these are engineering bays. So never mind. We can buy a shield, and then we can just upgrade our reactor. Yeah. Let's give that the old upgrade. A little more energy. That's the most amount of energy I will upgrade it to this entire run. Two. Let's get out of here. So we're gonna go here, 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 here. That's the that's the path. Alright. Not far from your current position. A Solari merchant ship slows down in order to inspect the likeness of you being a potential client. We don't have the money. So that's... That's how that goes. Oh! Oh, I just noticed a faster path. Uh, bump, bump. Bump, bump. But I think that's one with less fuel. Maybe it isn't. Sir, we're registering a short-range emergency signal from an escape pod up ahead. Your crew carefully scanned the pod and opened it in the airlock. Middle-aged man. Hey, it's this guy again. Get in my... Get in my... I'm just... No, we're just gonna get in my brig right now. Where's the nearest Starkin station? Over here? It is impossible for me to get there. That's okay. You come across an advanced combat vessel. Its mission is to enforce Solari law and secure control of the region. The ship identifies you as being in violation of Solari controlled space and is engaging combat protocols. Ugh. Well, we do have a lot of resources to fire. If only we could draw the things that let us. That's okay. We're gonna we're gonna do this. Reactor's overheating. It's free shield. Uh, yeah, let's fire. Wait. Yeah. Works every time. And then we throw the shield up. Wait a minute. Oh, that didn't shred. It didn't work every time. So I have to do this. So that we don't overheat. I can do this. Or I can do this.
Damn it. Minimum damage. Uh... This is enough to protect us. So... I'll go with that. Time to blow them up. Uh, I think this is a kill. Damn it. It's still a kill, question mark? If I... Do this. Ammo allocator. Reduce the next flak attack cost by one every time you deal minimum flak damage. Oh, that would have paid off so hard this fight. Increased conduction. Where's the other force draw? I guess this isn't bad. This is not bad. Sure. Because churning through heat does power our reactor. Uh, bum, bum, bum. I think it's safe to go here. And then this didn't actually save any fuel, but that's okay. Captain, permission to report. Our scanners are picking up signs of combat up ahead. A Solari unarmed ship is being attacked by a deadweight gunship. The civilian ship's hull integrity is critical. If we are to intervene in time, our only option is to fire on the attacking ship and draw its attention. Firing our weapons without initiative, initiating combat protocols first will leave our ship at a disadvantage. I like fighting. A bit worse. At the start of each turn, play one heated shell and sustain two heat. So we just gotta we just gotta get our shields up there, crank them up. Shields up, Captain. Get them get them maxed out, you know. Uh I don't wanna play I don't wanna play this for sure. I don't think I wanna play this because I wanna force draw. Play this to max our heat. If we assume that we're not going to break any weapons, then we need to get our shields really high. Play this so we don't overheat. Do this so we don't overheat. And then shoot this at the torpedo, because I don't want to deal with that. can bust something else, or we can just play an auto shield. I would have rather that had given me another shield, but I guess I'm out. Which is okay. Uh, I don't want to fire this. Not yet. Okay, good. Wait. Okay, good. There we go. Cascade shot. Okay. Pyroelectric round generates four heat. Uh, four damage, not four heat. We can do this to break the spread shot, and then we can cascade shot.
It also gives a melting clip. Uh, I'll just never play these. It's fine. I'll, I'm not going to play that. Okay, now that our shields are down, it's worth discarding our hand. Oh, I just win. It's fine. It's fine. Ordnance search. No. Heat shift? No. No. Yay! A little bit of hole repaired. Good job. But it's conflict zone. Deadweight conflict zones are impossible to police with the limited resources of the local factions. A deadweight ship is locked onto our drive signature and is approaching from starboard. It's always starboard, huh? Okay, well we've got this nonsense coming at us immediately. Took care of that. Fire this off. And we can increase our conduction. Missile's coming. That's fine. This is guaranteed to shred. This is not guaranteed to shred, and it didn't. That's okay. Uh, I don't want to play the barrier yet. Ugh. Alright, let's sustain a bunch of heat. Yeah, it's fine. We can take it. Maybe we can't take it. 5 to 13 damage. Alright, if I play this... That should increase my maximum damage. You know? Before I do that, let me just get some insurance. Alright. 5 to 14 damage. Is that how math works? Is that how math works? I don't think that's true. I mean, that's a lot of damage. Six to 10. Ah, uh, no. Mass surge, no. Maybe? Was this good? I don't think this was bad. It just needed a lot of energy, which we have energy. I'll take it. Maybe I'll regret it, but I'll take it. I need to learn. All right, now we're coasting. An unregistered ship president contested Solari space is approaching on an attack vector. I really need to get a PDC. Alright, we got Flak Barrage coming. So we're gonna play this and that it solves the Flak Barrage. It's solved. I want heat. I do want heat. Do I fire this first? I think I do. I think there's no downside to firing this first. Didn't get it. Damn it. Shred. 
tread. Tread. Nope. Really scratched. All right. Well, we got plenty of shields, so this is fine. This is fine. Now we've got ion damage coming. Ugh. Well, we've got to play this. That much is basically certain. I might as well play this and then... They have a repulsor field? Great. So our minimum damage is zero. Enemy down. But we got max damage. Was it max damage? It was max damage. Nice. Okay, this is guaranteed to do at least one damage. One to five. That was one. Titanium shells. Break that, please. Play this out. Throw this away. I do not like that card. It's not right. It's not correct. Ew. Can we get shields up? Wow. That's that's all we got? It's disgusting. Enemy shields down. I need another one. Disgusting. At least we at least we didn't get flacked. But still disgusting. Alright. Well, it's totally safe to play this. We might as well. Fire that off. Uh and then this is almost a kill. Almost. Yay, we drew a weapon. So that's a kill. Alright, optimization. No. Hey, a little hole is patched up. That's a Solari station. I don't care about them. I want the Starkin one. I do not want to dock, so let's move on. Conflict zone disliked. Deadweight conflict zones are impossible to police with the limited resources of the local factions. A deadweight ship has locked in on our dry signature and is approaching from starboard. Yay, spread shot. At least we drew auto shield. I don't need to play another one. Play this for the heat. Play this for the heat. Uh, and then I could break. Nothing I can really break. To be honest, I can I can get ready to break this. Okay. Lots of heat. Fire this. It's guaranteed to shred. Because we got a lot of heat. And this is guaranteed to shred. Can I get that back and try again? Oh, I can.
Nice. Plus that, and then we put the shield up. It's very lucky that the shield blocked both of those things. Uh, I want the kill. I want the kill. I think this is a guaranteed kill, anyway. Yeah, it is. No, stop giving me that. Alright, it's trade security time. When you get to the rendezvous point, you find a civilian cargo ship already waiting. You match speed and flight paths, and then proceed to run silent along the massive freighter. Before long, you pick up the signal of the pirate ship, heading straight for the freighter. Its civilian grade sensors have not picked up the enemy ship yet. What do you want to do, Captain? I'll shoot it. Oh, we get combat advantage. You manage to catch the enemy ship by surprise, gaining the initiative in combat. So we're just going to play our hand. Whatever we draw, we're going to play everything. You appear to be in our hand, so you get played. You get played. You get played. You get played. Uh, you get played. One more, please. Really scratched. That's fine. Incoming. Two missiles. Ugh. Uh, does this... Kill? That does nothing. Does this... Okay, we can play an auto shield. To give us a barrier, which which does. Uh, we need to get rid of our energy. This will get rid of our energy. Cool. Get rid of that. We can sustain two heat. No damage. Eat it. Oh, I should equip this. That's a... I. There's no reason for me not to equip that. Add a card. Mass Surge, no. Incoming transmission from the Sublari patrol ship. Congratulations on the successful mission. You have proven yourself worthy of our trust. The credits have been transferred to your account. I hope we meet again, Captain. Yay, now we're not enemies. Now we're neutral. Please allocate ammo to that. Thank you. The ship's comms pick up a nearby distress call. Shortly after moving in to investigate, the infrared sensors flare up from an explosion. The wreckage in front of us appears to be the source of the signal our sensors detected. The ship's reactor is close to a critical state, and could explode at any time. No survivors detected on board. Do you want to move in closer and inspect the wreckage? Let's start inspecting it. 30% success rate, 10% wreck explodes in 6 hull damage. Chance. You try to maneuver the salvage drone to get a good angle, but the gripper mechanism breaks off from the tension as it tries to dislodge the equipment from its hard point. The reactor's coolant has started leaking from the wreckage. Uh oh. Suddenly you see a bright light flash emanating from the location of the wreck. While our ship was quite a distance away, some debris impacts our hull and totally destroys the scavenger drone. Whoops. Anyway, it's time to coast to the boss. You are hailed by a maintenance ship that's further ahead on your flight path. 
It offers to service your ship's equipment for a price. The ship slows down and matches your flight path. Soon enough, they initiate a docking request to come on board. I would like to remove a card, please. Uh, this one? Get that out of here. I have regrets. The maintenance crew stand ready to provide their services. I'm good. Let's fight a boss. As your ship heads towards the breachway corridor leading out of the system, its sensors pick up a large fleet of unregistered ships forming in the asteroid belt and heading towards the blockade. Heavy fighting appears to be imminent, Captain. It might seem risky, but we could use the chaos to slip by undetected. It's not like we're left with too many choices by the looks of it. Suddenly, the approaching fleet launches a massive coordinated attack, wiping out half the defending blockade force. Most of the ships are engaged in fighting as you approach, but a massive retrofitted industrial ship is breaking off course and heading to intercept your ship. Turn back or I'll be forced to open fire. This is no place for privateers. People have taken matters into their own hands. I guess we're gonna have to fight our way out of this. Same ship every time. So... He didn't draw a lot of weapons, but we did draw this. Shoot it at... This is, this is going to be really annoying, but I'm going to shoot it at this. Uh, we can play increased conduction. No, we don't need to. We can play our shields to absorb the incoming titanium shells. Throw that away. I mean, I guess I can play this. There's no reason not to. Shielding enhanced. Oh, dang, that was a lot of damage. Alright. Don't have a way to generate a lot of heat. So, we're just doing this. Good, good. Are we lucky? Can we get a four? We did. Uh, do I play auto shield? I think I do. Yeah. We're not that lucky. Shielding enhanced. Okay, that's fine. Auto shield to auto shield. This is annoying. They have improvised flak up. Uh, well, what I can do is I can assume that this is going to shoot at me. So I'll just play this. I can fire this. Won't do much damage. Play that. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Expulsion. This might be a good turn to set up. Might be. Throw that down. Uh. No. No, we're not playing that. Cool. This is this an ongoing upgrade? Nope. These are not ongoing. I need to break the shields now. Get some heat. Get this going. Enemy shields down. This can't break anything. Uh. Get set up on this. Because that's going to be annoying. And then we. Balance production, play the barrier, and we block the flak.
All right. Good luck. Okay, auto shield can only give us four shields because our deck is empty. So what if we're just really lucky? Can we just be really lucky? I don't want to play this. I will sit on it. Damn. One damage. Oh no. Uh, this is a kill. Ooh, a pulse laser. And an AI core. And money. Alright, nope, nope, nope. I'll take the melting clip. I'll take it. to the sector exit. Captain, we are entering the AO system. One fuel harvested while transiting the breachway corridor. Your ship picks up two distress calls from the sector. Alright, well we can just do this. could also do this, but that's sketchier. We need to pick up two fuel. One fuel, because we already have one fuel. Collect the bounty on my prisoner. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to find a Solari station to drop him off, because that's what the achievement is. Pick one fuel up. Crew activities. Get a lot of morale for not a lot of money. Enter the hangar. Ooh, a missile rack. Corruptor. I've never seen this before. What does it do? Produce enemy damage by one for every attack card in its hand. For four turns, increase the enemy shredding by one. These are the tamest hacks ever. These seem like what the, the computer would be using. Attack Forge. Add one card slot and reduce attack cooldown by two this turn. Draw two attack cards. Requires five production. Deal plus one damage. Upkeep don't take any whole damage. Next attack this turn gains plus one damage for each attack card in the enemy's hand. Sustain one heat. Kinda lame, but I might try this. Plus, flak max damage for one turn every second flak attack played in the same turn. I want that, so I'm gonna get that. But let me let me finish reading. Uh, spectrum, nope. Reading panel, we can't take it because we already have it. Shield initiator, nope. Cascade event. Each time you break the enemy shield with an ion attack, we don't have an ion weapon. So aim corrector, get in here. Attack forge, get in here. We're gonna install this AI core. We're gonna sell this. And this. Do I buy the missile rack? Nah. Max repair. I think this wants us to increase our mass. No, 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 I need to increase, I need to increase ordinance so I can play attack mode. There it is. All right, let's see if this component was a mistake. Buy an extra fuel. 
All right, we're looking for a Solari station. Of course, that's the one station we don't see. That's okay, though. Go this way first. Uh, but before we do... Captain, permission to report. Our scanners are picking up signs of combat up ahead. No, permission denied. Don't report. I don't want to hear your report. I'm not, I'm not listening. I'm not listening. Oh, a Solari unnamed, unarmed ship is being attacked by a dead weight gun ship. We could draw the attention of the attacking ship. I like fighting. The ship has two guns on it for a reason, and it's not self-defense. The ship has one gun on it. That's for self-defense. Offensive Assurance. This will do 7 damage, and this will do 7 damage. That's 14 damage. That's... Lovely. Next turn, we will... Begin the barrage. Uh, we don't have that much tactical resource, so I don't want to, I mean, I'm going to fire. I just don't want to go all in. Now we're going to start firing missiles at us. stuff. Oh no, our shield. Oh, that's gross. Alright, give this to them, because we've been hacked. Put this out. Auto shield up, so that we don't get hit. reading this card and like conceptually I understand how it works but I'm trying to figure out why you would want this it makes sense in a, in a world where you have unlimited resources but I don't have unlimited resources this is this is card draw though so I'm like I'm here for it I'm not I'm not saying this is bad I'm just not understanding it all right we can pyroelectric up to Five damage. Play a radiate to go back down. Oh, this will just break that. Okay, great. I don't need to think anymore. Just turn that brain off. Uh, do I play the asteroid or I don't think I even want to play the blazing barrage anymore. Uh, no, I do. I do. I definitely do. Well, I can't anymore. I play this. Because we're about to... Yeah. Yeah. Actually, it didn't matter. I didn't notice the enemy hit point. Total. I was just looking at heat. Microcharge. Attacks that cost two or less do plus one damage. You know what? Most of my attacks cost two or less. Get in here. Get in here. All right, next conflict zone. Stop asking permission to report. A 
Stark and unarmed ship is being attacked by a Solari gunship. The civilian ship's hull integrity is critical. Unidentified vessel, stay out of Stark and affairs. Uh, I like fighting, but I don't want to make friends with the Starkin, and I don't want to make enemies with the Solari, so I'm gonna, gonna let that one slide. Alright. Incoming transmission from a Solari patrol ship up ahead. Captain, we are in dire need of assistance. Lately, we've been overwhelmed by reports of deadweight ships plundering what remains of the Concordia. This assault on the cradle of humanity can't be tolerated. This fleet is looking for a gunship willing to take on the contract of destroying three deadweight ships. You'll get paid 150 credits upon contract completion. Cool. I don't know why you wouldn't say yes. We are transmitting the location of the deadweight ships, but any pirate will do. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Combat zones are off limits to non allied ships. A Solari gunship takes your unauthorized presence as a sign of aggression and moves into attack. No, you. Attack mode. I think I want to play this first for the energy. Play that. Uh, I do want to force draw, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. Throw that away. I don't want this, or do I? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I want to force draw. Okay. That didn't get me my asteroid. But I think increased conduction is good. Okay. Uh, shield pulse or barrier? I want the barrier. Yeah, and the, oh, I can play them both actually. Good. Good thing I play them both. Cool, and I drew both auto shields, so... Good for me. Good for me. Okay. Can't play this, can't play much else. There's no point in playing this. It won't even break the shield. Throw that out. Uh, yeah. Damn it, one damage. All right, we can play this. Do four damage. Then we can play this to break that. Play this to break that. And then some play some weapon coolant. Yeah. Oh. Oh, we're gonna go all in now. You you're done. You're done. Bust the shield down, throw these away. Or straw. Deterrence. Five to 20 damage. 11, that's average. Six to nine damage. Oh, this isn't a kill? Wait a minute. It needs to be a kill. Yeah, I sh 
ship was a little hot. Conservation no return fire. Your next attack this duration gains plus one damage for each incoming missile. That's a little too niche. That's a little too niche. Yay, we fixed that damage that we took. I was worried. Alright, we're still looking for a Starkin station. Okay, a Solari unarmed ship is being attacked by a Starkin gunship. Uh, if we were to intervene in time, our only option is to fire on the attacking ship and draw its attention. Sure. I will fire on this ship. Oh. Well, damn. <laughs> okay, that was mean. Okay, we can auto shield, and we might need to. Uh, we need to empty our hand to get that contingency model. Module. I think we just go with this. Break the shield. Uh, pull this back out. Damn it. All right. Get those out of here. So we're going to take one more damage. Just kidding. We're going to take three more damage. It's not the time to play Offensive Assurance, because we're about to take attack. Or about to take hull damage. They have no attack cards in their hand. So this is useless. Uh, we can do something like this. Oh, I want to empty my hand. I do want to empty my hand. And if I do empty my hand... Reactor's overheating. We will get... Six shield, which blocks the torch beam, so that I do get to keep offensive assurance. Microcharge? They've got a preemptive blast. Uh, but if we empty our hand, I think, I think we'll stop it. Or we can just do this. Yeah. So I empty my hand. Attack mode. Why does this feel like I'm doing so little damage? What's in my- what am I drawing? Radiate, weapon coolant, expulsion. That's three heat, seven. Yeah, I should do this. This will, this will, uh, shred.
This will do eight damage, which is not enough to break anything, but we do have an auto shield, which will give us four shield. Can throw that away. Can play this. And that. Kill now? Can we kill? I think we can. Uh. Yeah. Wait, no. Shoot. Throw that away, throw that away. Throw it all away. Just throw it all out. Okay, now we can kill. Steel Resolve. Next attack this turn gains plus one damage for each hack on you. What? What are these? Like... It costs two energy and three mass to get plus one damage if you've been hacked. How many hacks are going to be on you? More than two? No. Energy surge. That's... I don't... I don't want that. Bring on the elite. come across an advanced combat vessel. Its mission is to enforce Stark in law and secure control of the region. The ship identifies you as being in violation of Stark in controlled space and is engaging combat protocols. This is my nightmare. Uh, power this up. Play attack mode. Good opening salvo. We were hacked. Uh oh. Kill that. Kill that. And I don't need to do anything else. Uh, I will discard these. Reboot equipment. Oh, that's nothing. Great. Offensive assurance. Increased conduction. Nice to see some firebrand combat. And hi. Hello. Welcome. Play that out. Put that out. We got no concerns at the moment because all their weapons are busted and their shield is just, it's just there. It's not doing much. Uh, I think we can break them. Deterrence, they're playing, they have two attacks. So this is plus two damage. What can I break? Hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute, what is this? Enemy laser attacks until minus two damage while I shield it. I don't have a laser. I don't care. Get that out of here. Uh, is this a kill? It is a kill. That's a kill.
Excellent. Ooh, we're gonna command you. Oh, wow, okay. Microcharge, yes. What are shatter rounds? Equipments destroyed with the railgun attacks take plus one turn to repair. That's cool. Oh, Marcus Chinukaka. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. I like microcharge, because most of our things, we've already established that most of our things cost two or less ordnance, so you know. This is I this looks good. This looks good. I do like that, but I'm taking it. I am still looking for a Starkin station to drop off my prisoner for the achievement. I see no station. I see a station of the other two factions that have stations that you can see. Oh well. Uh, this is the... wait, where is... This was the distress call, right? So we can go to here. Bomb, bomb. Uh, I don't know how we get to the station if we do that. Let's get to here and decide if I'm gonna go for this distress call or if I'm gonna go for this station. An unarmed Solari civilian ship is being attacked and is requesting assistance from any allied gunships in the, the vicinity. I don't know why I would ever ignore that. I get paid to blow up ships. <laughs> No damage this turn, so I'll just go ham. Hmm, how can I generate heat? With this? Yes. Alright, I think I can do better. I would be wrong. I don't want to play this, I want to play this. Not lucky enough. Put this out, and then... Uh, set this up to break next turn. Okay, can we do 10 damage? Can we do 10 damage and play this auto shield? We can, if we ask the crew nicely. Auto shield. Block that off. Uh, oh, wait a minute. This is going to do bonus damage. Can't do anything about that. I'm going to take two damage. What we can do. Uh, is it time to play this? No, because then we can't fire. Play weapon coolant, get our heat up. Enemy shields down. Uh, and then... I mean, we might as well. There's no, no advantage to storing heat. Here we go. All right, wild turn time. Put that out. Uh, we can play the shield. I'm gonna discard this and this. We can play this just in case. Let's, let's get hot. Here we go. Cool off a little, cool off a little, cool off. A oh, we just win. Okay, cool. <laughs> cool off completely. Great. 
Cautious Tactics. What is this? Plus one damage. If you avoid any damage, this card becomes an upgrade on Expire. How is that different from this? Oh, I guess, I guess, I guess I see it. Is it worth plus two mass? Probably not. But it is, it is a yellow, it, it does have a yellow name, so I'm gonna take it anyway. I give every rare a chance. Is that true? As soon as I said that, I was like, that's not true, is it? All right, we have one more sector to go before we decide if we're gonna go here or if we're just gonna move on. Ah, traversing Stark in conflict zones is strictly prohibited. A patrol ship moves in to intercept. Incoming beam. We'll just we'll just stop that right now. No beam. No problem. Uh do I play this? Or do I go ham? I think I can go ham. We got the shield up, we can go ham. We bust this down. We don't really need to worry about the beam. Reactor's overheating. It's fine. Don't worry, the reactor's fine. Don't draw our shield, don't draw our shield, don't draw our shield. Damn it! <laughs> well, this is junk. And just throw this away right now. Uh I gotta play this to absorb that that beam. And that's probably fine. This is probably fine. We can just stockpile up resources. They're gonna fire an ion missile. I don't know how we're gonna deal with that. So, step one, shield pulse. No, I want to play this. Okay, we do this for extra energy. Then we shield pulse, then we play attack mode. Can use this to take the shield down. If I reduce my uh, production, does this go away? Let's find out. Looks like it's still there. Uh, I I think I think that stopped working. Let me just. No, no, it still works. So this will this will take the shield down completely. Yeah, just bring that shield down. Uh, I don't, I can play one of these. I don't think there's any reason to stockpile energy. Let me just check my deck. Ba -ba -ba. Any of these cards matter? Uh, this would be good. No, it wouldn't, it doesn't matter. It's all plus one attack anyway. Play this now, throw this one away. Do we shoot the tungsten? Yeah. Yeah. Force draw. Damn it. Wait a minute, I just noticed they're not shooting a weapon, so this I didn't need to raise the shield. <laughs> uh it's fine. Put that there. And that's it. I don't have any mass, so we're done. I'm just going to get to shoot for free. Beam discharge, what the heck? Oh. OK, 
Okay, we gotta take that out. I don't have the mass. I don't have the mass to take that out. That's bad. Do I have shields in my... Anywhere? Why did I focus on this? I should have... I should... I didn't... I did not know that that was gonna happen. Okay. Well... Power that up, because I need the heat. Fire this. Fire that. Oh, okay. Uh, excellent. I should pay attention to the Radiant Core, because that just triggered. It's not what I wanted. Damn. Well. Didn't matter. 16 damage. Reactor's overheating. Oh, there's my asteroid ore. There you are. All right, let's just finish this now, please. Play deterrence. Where were you one turn ago? Mass surge could have saved that, so I will, I will add that to the deck, and feel very sad that I have to add that to the deck. Uh... Okay, I'd rather go here than here, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah. Hey, okay. Repair station. System map show disaffected repair station located in this quadrant. Location added to the nav system. An unarmed Solari civilian ship is being attacked and is requesting assistance from any allied gunships in the vicinity. Say no more. There's no weapon. Prep volley. Add one counter on the end of each turn. On reaching three counters, fire three fire fire missiles. Let's just blow that up. Let's just not let that happen. Do I mass surge? I could mass surge. Play this, because we're going to generate a lot of heat in just a moment. Not bad. Play this. Shredded enemy hull. Can we lower our heat? No. Oh, why can't I play this? What? Did I miscount? I did. heat. Oh, we did lower our heat. Okay, yeah, we're good. We're good. So we just do this. And now we are set. Oh, is this not ongoing? So where did this firefly come from? I'm confused. Why do I only have shields in my hand? That's not funny. This is... This will draw me a shield, right? Okay, good. Uh, we can play... A micro charge? Get that set up. Does this also fire a one of these? Damn it, I didn't draw because I'm an idiot. Uh, I need to discard. 
pull one of you out, please. Okay, this has to shred. This is guaranteed to shred. Yeah. Oh, that was an ongoing upgrade. Oh, but they're firing because of each broken thing. Got it. Well, you know what? I'm about to get blown up. Incoming missile. Yeah. Yeah, yep. Okay. So... It's, uh, there's only 12 damage coming my way right now. Oh, that's it. Uh, Bob, that's a lot of damage. I need to dump my hand to get three more shield. Shielding enhanced, Captain. And then obviously if this torpedo hits us, it's GG. So we have to kill them now. We have so much ordnance. Uh, like this is just a kill, right? Why is their shred so high? I'm confused. I haven't been hitting them that many times. Gain one energy for every two ordnance you spend. Uh, where are the Starkin bases? Let's go to this waypoint. Captain, our sensors have just picked up what appears to be an unmarked credit cache not too far from here. Uploading the coordinates. Nice. All right, let's get repaired. Let's dock and attempt to do some repairs. Might not look like it, but some of the equipment left here is actually in good working condition. 12 whole points repaired after your engineer gets to work with the assistance of the rest of the crew. Nice. We can hit here, 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 hit the station, and then final boss time. Incoming message from a deadweight captain. It seems to be coming from a nearby ship marked as a civilian freighter. What do you want to do, captain? Let's patch him through. Hey, old friend. You seem to be a well-armed gunship. Might you be looking to earn a nice lump of credits and reap some spoils? The system is rife with chaos, and being on our good side will see you become a rich man in no time. Got a special transponder here, and all you need to do is equip it on your ship and attack that solitary, scarred, darkened patrol vessel further up ahead. With absolutely no further repercussion, I might add, because they won't be able to trace the attack to you. What do you say? Sir, the transponder belongs to a Solari vessel. Attacking one of ours with it will spark a local conflict in an already tense situation. Hey, let's attack this pirate. The transponders must be destroyed. And I really don't care about my pirate reputation at this point. Damn, that's a big ship. Why is it so big? Um. Well, the good news is it's not firing anything this turn, so we can just shoot it. Put that out there. Do we just radiate? Sure. Radiate for power. Deal seven damage. Deal two to eight damage. Oh, so close. All right. Here comes the pain. Put that 
that out. Put that out to get more heat. Let's try this again. Great, minimum damage. Shielding enhanced, Captain. Oh, this is fine. I have plenty of shields. <laughs> what am I doing? Ah. Uh. About to get our shield tacked. That sucks. Get some weapon coolant. Mass surge. Yeah, let's fire. No, because I want shredding. I want shredding. Let's do this first. Oh, uh, and then let's do it again. just gonna leech defenses, right? So I can... I don't need to, to like, do anything. Uh, I can reduce my heat. That doesn't hurt. Alright, we can't play our shield. Because we've been hacked. This won't do anything. Throw that away. This will do four damage to a thing. Attack mode be good? Maybe. If we play this, we might be able to get more mass if we force production. Nope. Oh, we're going to be taking two damage. Do I have an asteroid? I have no mass production in my deck right now, so this is all we got. Can play this. There's no harm in it. Get that heat up. Sure. Now, if I lower heat, my radiant core will trigger. No, it won't. Because I need to dissipate 12 heat. And I only have 9. But if I play this, that will trigger. And so it did. And now I have way too much tactical. Way too much ordnance. I really need non-ordnance production. Anyway, let's blast these guys. No. Do I have mass production in my deck yet? Next turn. Uh, get that out of here. Let's do eight damage. I can bump that up to nine.
play this to get some heat. Seven to ten damage. Enemy shields down. Okay. This is a kill, I think. Yeah, this is a kill. Blueprint. Draw two support cards. All support cards cost one less mass this turn. None of my support cards. That's not true. These costs. That's actually possibly good. Sure. I do need mass. I do need mass so much that I will upgrade my reactor just to make that make that so. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. All right, let's visit this allied waypoint. The main console indicates a minor malfunction in the reactor system. Your crew tries to diagnose the problem, however, are unable to identify and repair it without more sophisticated equipment. What does this mean? Remove one reactor power from a random resource. Well, that sucks. All right, let's go here. The signal you picked up leads to what was once a trading and logistics hub. There's an encrypted credit cache floating amongst the debris that hasn't been tampered with. You quickly attempt to hack it with you onboard computer before anyone else picks up the signal and shows up. Cache is encrypted with a multi-layer lock. You manage to use the ship's computer to brute force your way past the first layer and access part of the available credits. Our sensors indicate a neutral station up ahead. What are your orders, Captain? Let's talk with it. Let's get this bounty because we're not finding a Starkin. Let's fix this malfunction because holy crap. Uh, we've got a crew activity. Sell that off. A PDC array would be good. PDC array would be good. That's just good. A module discharger, we don't have ion. Not getting a cycle feeder. Command unit. Can we get two of these? And put them on the same thing? Let's find out. Oh yeah. Get that. Let's, let's repair up. That's an interesting price. 10 and eight. I like those numbers. And then, to finish off, let's buy a card, because we are not fighting anymore. It's a PDC burst, good. I bet I'm gonna need that. Let's go. Depart the station. All right, boss time. This is the end of the run. Win or lose. Heading for the sector exit, your sensors pick up a massive vessel inbound on an attack vector. The sector is locked down. Any ships attempting to leave are marked for termination. Buckle up. Looks like we have to fight our way out. But we're allies. Preemptive blast. Uh, I need to empty my hand. Party parrot. Uh, 
Ba -ba pyroelectric. So I think I want to aim this at the command center. And this too. Um, draw two support cards. Oh, I should have played this. Yeah, I should have played that. No, I should have played this. That's better. We're going to have to discard everything else, so... Play this. Hope we get shredding. Nope. This is probably better. Alright, break that off. I thought the the expulsion would have fired, but I guess I guess not. I guess not. Mass surge. We do not have a lot of ordnance, but we do have a lot of other stuff. Let's fire this off. Fire this off. Hey, there we go. Make it happen. I'm I'm pretty sure okay, so does it so we're overheated, right? So this should fire. No, it doesn't. Okay. Confirmed. Does not fire. I've got a torpedo coming. I would like to shoot that down, please. Enemy missile is down. All right. And we can auto shield and shield pulse because we've got 16 damage coming our way plus plus through my 19 damage. Okay. Play that. Yeah. Yeah, just to take the shields down. Yeah. All right, then we'll fire that off to lower heat. It didn't lower heat. You have one job. <laughs> it's to lower heat. And do damage. I like this. I like seeing this. I wish I had a thing that let me generate energy in my deck. But I don't. I can generate heat. So I think this is strictly better. Than this. No, it isn't. This is better. Play that. Generating a little more heat. It's only three more cards in my deck, so there's no point in sustaining. Uh. Fire this off. Fire this off. Oh yeah, it's it's happening. This should be shredding. Why is it not reducing my heat? Okay, there we go. Maybe I was just insane. All right, we do that and then we will fire this off. This better reduce heat. I'm gonna be very upset if it doesn't. Okay, it did. We were hacked. Getting beamed.
Okay, I need to take down the shield. So, nothing they have is shooting at me right now. So I can just discard this. But there's no advantage to doing that at the moment. It means I can spend all of my energy on this jank. This is going to do 14 damage. That'll knock down the shield immediately. Uh, we can take this hyper laser down because that's scary. Enemy down. Take this laser down. We can take this torpedo down. I don't need to though. I've got a PDC blast ready. So we'll just shoot at the command station. Let's go. I have too much heat. Wait a minute. Is this a kill? This might just be a kill. Escalation 3 unlocked. More expensive station repairs. Well, that sucks. Nice. Thank you. Ooh. I'm sad because I didn't get to send Wolf to a Starkin station, so I'll have to get that achievement at some point in the future, but... Uh, Escalation 3 unlocked. Getting there. Well, that was a lot of fun.